Hey guys, so in this video, we are going to be taking a closer look at this really cool LED solar torch light with four different lighting effects as well as flame effect with a built-in Bluetooth speaker. So let me go ahead and show you the different four lightings that it comes in. First of all, of course, is the flame effect. The second mode is warm light, so it'll stay constant like this. The third lighting mode is bright white light. And lastly, the fourth lighting mode is dimmer white lights. My personal favorite is this flame effect right here, guys. Look how cool it looks. So here's the box as well as everything that was inside. First of all, we have a user manual. Next, we have a micro USB cable that will allow you to manually charge the lamp if you want, or else you can just leave it outside and it will recharge using the sun via the solar panel on top of it. And next, we have this little base that you can actually swap out on the lamp right here that will allow you to either have the lamp standing on these poles or you can actually have it hanging upside down, whichever option you want. And of course, we have two poles here you can actually connect these two poles like this and then actually connect it to our lamp right here and then you can actually stick it on the front yard or as well as your backyard and of course lastly we have our led solar torch light with flame effect as well as a built-in speaker guys now to give you a general idea of how big this torch light actually is it is 8.5 inches from top to bottom and 3.7 inches from left to right so it is actually about the same size as any real fire torch light now if you attach this pole to it the total height comes out to be is 26 inches and that's actually a perfect height for you to stake it down on your front yard as well as your backyard so let's go ahead and take a closer inspection at the actual product itself now when i first took this out of the box i actually thought the body was made out of some type of you know hot iron or metal but it's actually made out of some type of pretty good quality plastic if you tap on it like this you know that it's plastic but it feels pretty good in quality and right here in the middle as you can see you have four different buttons control so to turn on the bluetooth speaker all you have to do is hold this power button right here down for about two or three seconds and then the bluetooth speaker will turn on and you can actually connect it wirelessly using your phone laptop computer it works with all apple devices as well as android devices and pretty much any devices as long as your device has bluetooth next to it we have this mind sign button this is to decrease the volume simply hold this button down to decrease the volume and to increase the volume of the music simply hold this button down that have the plus sign hold it down and the volume will increase and you can quick press the plus button to go to the next song or quick press the minus button to go to the previous song and lastly all the way to the right here we have this light bulb picture this is for you to turn on the light bulb as well as to switch to the different lighting mode and over here if you open this little thing right here this is where if you want to recharge this lamp manually you can actually connect it to a micro usb cable that comes inside the box and then you can recharge it that way or else again guys you can just simply leave it outside and it will recharge on its own using the sun via this solar panel up here on top and lastly next to the charging port you also have a micro sd core slot if you want to go ahead and put in the sd cord in here and play the music directly from the sd cord you can also do that but for me personally i have just been using the wireless bluetooth feature and connecting it to my phone and play music directly from my phone inside the house and blasting music to the outside of the house letting people enjoy the christmas season and christmas music at the same time which is really really cool now right below here where all these openings are this is actually where the speaker is located so if you take a closer look in there that's where the speaker is rested right there and this entire lamp right here is also rated ipx6 waterproof meaning you can actually leave this in the rain if you want and it will be fine and lastly the base right here guys you can simply pull this out and again you can hang this upside down like this wherever you want and have a really really nice looking lamp or if you want you can actually remove this base altogether by simply twisting it like this so let's go ahead and take this base out now the only reason you will want to remove this is if you want to attach the pole on there and then stick it on your grass so after you remove that you can simply put this base on there by simply again retwisting it on there now what this allows you to do is it allows you to connect the lamp onto the pole like I showed you earlier and then you can simply stick it onto your grass. So now all we have to do is put it in here and then we are ready to roll guys. Now we can stick it on our backyard, front yard or wherever you want to guys. 
So let's go ahead and power it on, make sure everything is working fine, and then we'll bring it outside to show you how good it actually looks during the night. Now, of course, this automatically power on during nighttime and automatically power off during brightness like you're seeing right now. So to turn it on, make sure everything is working perfectly. All you have to do is cover the solar panel right here completely with your hand just like this, and then press the power button right here with the light bulb all the way over to the right. Press it one time, and as you can see, the light turns on in flame effect. And check this out, as soon as I move my hand, brightness comes and the light automatically power off. When night times come, light bulb automatically power on. And you can simply switch through the different lighting mode by simply pressing the lighting button again. So press it once more, and then it goes to the warm light, bright white light, dim white light, once more to turn it off, once more to turn it back on. So you want it to be on this on position if you were to leave it outside 24 seven and then it'll automatically power off during the day and auto power on when it comes to nighttime. And if you want to use the Bluetooth speaker, all you have to do is hold this power button all the way over to the left, hold it down for about three seconds. Bluetooth mode. So you will hear that sound. Bluetooth is connected successfully. So as you can hear, you will definitely know that the Bluetooth speaker is on and then connected to your phone. And now you can actually play your music wirelessly through your phone and the light comes on at the same time, which is really, really cool. All right, guys, so I am outside in my backyard. I'm gonna turn the lamp on. And as you can see it, it actually gives out a good amount of light. And it looks a lot better in person actually. So the flame effect doesn't show that well on camera, but in person it actually really does look like a real flame light. So let me go ahead and switch through the different modes to let you see. So here's the warm light, white light, dimmer white light, and back to the flame effect. Looks really, really nice. So let's go ahead and take it out by the lake. So let's go ahead and walk back. So we are about 10 foot, 15. So we're about 20 foot away now, guys. Actually looks really, really cool. So I'm gonna change through the different lighting modes. Now for a last test, I'm gonna turn on some music to show you how good the audio quality is. So let's go ahead and hit play. So it's at about 50% right now. I'm gonna turn it on max. Let's go back a little bit further. We're about five foot away now. I'm gonna walk back to 20 foot. So we're about 20 foot away now. And so guys, that is the LED solar torch light with flame effect as well as a built-in Bluetooth speaker. If you want to check it out for yourself, link will be in the description box below.